What's up troopers? So I just had a, another video idea kind of spinning off of the last video uh, regarding the Scott Genius. Uh, when purchasing a new or used mountain bike, the first thing you should do that I learned the hard way uh, with a new or used bike is to instantly go online and type in the name of that bike and the word problems after or defects or warranty keywords like this into Google. It will take you to any forums um, regarding issues with that bike that you're purchasing so you can either address the issue before purchasing, um, if it's, especially if it's from a shop or something like that, or if you're buying used, um, you can let the person know um, what, you know, talk to them about it. At least you're well informed on what you're purchasing. And that's something I learned the hard way. So something I'll be doing in the future whenever I'm purchasing anything really. Um, I mean, I always look, uh, look up reviews, but it's instead of always looking up reviews, because most people that, most people, not all people, but most people that want to review something are going to give you all the good things about the product. Um, whereas if you type actually search for what you're looking for, which is problems, you don't want to know what's what's good about an Apple phone. Uh, you want to know before you purchase it what's bad or what's wrong with the Apple phone compared to other phones or maybe some issues that that current model has been experiencing like overheating and things like remember Samsung phones like lighting on fire and stuff like that. So it's always good to search instead of always searching for reviews on a product I would search for problems with a product because Again, there's so much information in forums out there. If you Google stuff, you're going to get exactly what you're looking for. So if you're looking for, um, always looking for like reviews and people that are doing like, um, kind of like upselling on certain items, um, they're always going to give you all the good stuff and not as much or very little of the bad stuff or less focus on the bad stuff of a certain product. So yeah. Make sure you check out all the forums and stuff like that before purchasing, you know, new shocks and new derailers and tires and um, all these sorts of things before um, you actually go through with it. Um, hubs are a big one I've noticed over the last like four or five years when I hear people like talking about issues, lots of hubs exploding. Um, so again, just Google up that hub for that bike doesn't not necessarily the bike in that case because it's an accessory or a part of a bike so you can just google that part and see if there's been any issues in the last few years so you can address it before it becomes a real issue okay hope you guys like this video i'm gonna be coming at you with some more green screen stuff hopefully and just some more at home videos because like i said my bike is going to be mia for a little while and i'll also be working on uh, my other channel which is more like road bike and uh, like food and lifestyle videos. So you can go check that out on my main channel, it's just Matt Klein. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.